Do you guys want some cheap troll packs? Well then you're at the right place. Check out Cheap Punk. They have a variety of packs that Troll has to offer. At the end of your checkout, use the code DANNYTM for 6% off your order. Yo, what is going on guys? It's Dan and finally back with another YouTube video and today I want to talk to you guys about the new patch notes that have just came out or the new patch that has been rolled out to fix some issues. So let's get started because Troll is going to be down in 10 minutes and I really need to record this video very quick. So, um, first of all, the weekly events, Chaos Chess contest has been shuffled, uh, Fishing is here, Fishing is pretty much doubled. Um, Flask are on sale, hence the name. Uh, what's the name of this? Flasky Tuesday, as you could call it. I'm sorry if I'm leeching. I'm gonna finish the dungeon, uh, get my Empower Gem, and it's head back to Trouble Source, where I can focus on. So, um, that's pretty much it for the weekly changes. It's um, Chaos Chest, Fast Fishing, and Flask are on sale. Um, for the miscellaneous changes and bug fix fixes, um, right clicking on an item icon that is listed in the marketplace sale will now cancel the listing. So, if you right click an item, that you put up for, for in the market, it will automatically cancel if you just click it. Um, additional login to improve latency down the line. Uh, this should hopefully help when the trove server goes down and then when everybody logs on, it doesn't pretty much get you to a queue, I guess you could say. Um, fix the bug where interacting with the loot collector, then close the loot collector, then right click an item in your inventory, it wouldn't try to equip that item. So, you know, these are some minor bug fixes. Um, Fix bug where store sometimes didn't mean the digital purchase button. I have a buying product that cannot be repurchased. Big issue, so big issue that they had to fix it. I'm just kidding, guys. Uh, fix the bug where players could get stuck if they change class while dodging. I guess that could be a, a really, really big problem. Problem. Uh, fix an issue where the Ice Age Frozen Ward could could stick around after changing the class. So these are all some really, really minor, minor changes that really won't make a huge impact on your play, but will fix some people's impacts. And if you guys watched, or if you guys saw me, I finally got the Empowered Gem Box to get from the, um, uh, what do you call it? The Legendary Tome. So my idea is pretty much to load up, oh sorry, to load up on um, experience. Like put a tome, a random tome on, and then on Monday when everything resets, you just go and do one dungeon and you're done with that dungeon. And you get a free Empowered Box. So, um, enough rambling, you guys want to see me open it first, we're going to open the Respendant Gem Box first of course. And I'm really hoping for a class key gem because if I get a class key gem, I'm gonna be really excited. And his name Here we go, guys. What the hell, guys? What the hell? What are the chances of me getting a class key gem? Oh my god, guys, that's crazy! Oh my god, that that's incredible. So next tomorrow's video will be me getting my class gem. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. And I'm just crazy. That I got. The class key gem. Oh my god, what are the chances of that? Peace out, guys. Oh my god.